Hi everyone, I'm Amber Poole, also known as the Chakra Deva. Today I'm going to show you a crystal Reiki technique of how to have protection for yourself during the day. You must be attuned to crystal Reiki in order to use the symbols. However, you can use these crystals at any time to help you with your protection. So crystal Reiki is not the same as a Sui Reiki. They are different things. And crystal Reiki, you get attuned to 15 symbols. You have to be attuned, meaning a person who is attuned, a master, can attune another person. I am teaching crystal Reiki masterclass this October 1st, 2018. So please, if you are interested in registering for it or want to check it out and learn more of these tips and techniques, it is also on my site, thechakradiva.com. That's C-H-A-K-R-A -A, for those who don't know how to spell chakra. Okay, so what you want to do for protection and your aura is use a crystal like smoky quartz or another really good one would be a jet. You want to use a dark crystal, black usually, that absorbs energy. Black tourmaline will reflect energy, so please do not use black tourmaline. You want something that absorbs the vibrations. So I'm using smoky quartz today, and I'm also, in crystal Reiki, you are attuned to a, um, a heart crystal of your choice. So I am using my labradorite heart. There she is. Ain't she pretty? Labradorite is known for um, protection. So even if you are not crystal Reiki attuned, you can use a regular labradorite will do. So in order to do this, you take your wand, which we use in crystal Reiki, and I want you to put the life force energy, life force energy into your stone. And make sure that it goes clockwise. Make sure it's going out, okay? Because when you're, it's going out, that's how you're getting the vitality, the energy into the stone. So make sure that when you're doing the life force energy symbol, it's going out to add in energy. Inside decreases, takes energy. So you want to add in your energy and then put this stone at the bottom of your feet and set your intention. So when setting your intention, I like to fold my hands into my heart. Take a few breaths. I'm sending in the intention to release anything that is not of the light, anything that is negative, any thought forms, any attachments around me. And I'm sending my stress, anything that does not serve my highest good. I ask for my guides, my higher self to participate. And when I say my higher self, I do the higher self symbol right there, the spiritual energy symbol above my head. And down my hair line, which is the tube that runs through all of your chakras and holds them together, I want you to imagine or picture anything in your auric field around you collecting in to the bottom of your stone. So you scan yourself, scan your head. What does it feel like around you? Scan your shoulders. Scan all of your body and you want to put that energy into the stone at the bottom of your feet. And we thank this stone so much for collecting everything, okay? So after you do all of that, you're gonna take your labradorite or your heart that you attuned, and you're going to put the life force energy into your stone, hold it up to your heart, and then with this, you wanna say the principles that Crystal Reiki follows. Today I honor and have gratitude for all. Today I trust and worry not. Today I feel peace and not anger. Today I live in honesty. And today I embody kindness and respect for all creatures. So you close your eyes and you might just wanna work on one of them. Some days I just work on one. So today I honor and have gratitude for all. Or maybe today I trust and worry not. Sometimes I just pick one one thing to work on. Today I feel peace and not anger. So you might want to say them three times, but you close your eyes with your heart to your heart. And Labradorite is of protection. So I channeled the Reiki. It's coming from my head. It goes down through all of my chakras into my heart and out. And as I say them, today I have gratitude for all. Today, I honor and have gratitude for all. Today, I honor and have gratitude for all. 
I'm finding myself in the resonance of peace, the resonance of love, the resonance of light. And as I focus on those words, I'm shifting my energy from what took me out or depleted me to a more positive vibration. So as you hold it into your heart chakra, you're expanding out your love, your gratitude for all. And I imagine and picture it coming out of my heart and enveloping me, surrounding me in this beautiful, beautiful Reiki energy until I create a bubble around me. From head to toe, I just keep repeating one or I repeat all of them and I go into my little Zen place. Today I honor and have gratitude for all. Today I honor and have gratitude for all. Today I honor and gratitude for all. And so what happens is you create this big, beautiful surrounding of high vibrations. And guess what? Nobody want to mess with no high vibrations. Low energy wants to resonate with low energy. And you already dumped all of your junk into the smoky quartz or into your jet, right? So after you dump all of that stuff, you're going to release it. And then you put your heart up to your real heart, your heart on your heart, and you expand it out until you feel confident that you are surrounded in this beautiful protection of love and light. Now with your smoky quartz or jet, you want to cleanse it. Thank that guy for holding all of your crap in it, let me tell you. <laughs> These babies hold a lot in it. And I've even seen them crack and break when they, when they hold too much energy. They start to rock and then they break. It's the most amazing thing. So thank your babies, cleanse your babies, and keep them outside to rejuvenate them. Again, just to go over the basics, you are using the light force energy for protection in this technique. If you want more information on the Crystal Reiki Masterclass, please visit theshakradiva.com. Class starts in October. See you then.